Wendy and I were watching a TV show a few years ago about a family building a house. The design had been finished, the foundation was done, and the rest of construction was ready to begin. The outstanding feature of their house was that they were going to use a local wood sourced from a nearby forest, a kind of wood that had never been used before to build homes in that country. But that was the problem. Because that tree species had never before been used for building, the code enforcement officials stopped construction. The wood first had to be tested for strength. And as frustrating as that was to the family building the house, it was necessary. If the wood isn't strong enough, there's no reason to build the house, right? Good news, the wood was tested by engineers and it was even stronger than necessary. The house was finished. Last week we studied about the baptism of Jesus, which marks the beginning of his ministry. But then Jesus surprises us again. His first ministry task is not to go be with people, it is to go to the wilderness by himself for testing. Before the house can be built, the wood must first be tested. Sunday, we're going to study Matthew chapter 4, 1 through 17. It may be a familiar story to you, but I think there's so much wisdom in it for us as we deal with our own testing and temptations. For the next week or two, notice when you are tempted and what tempts you the most. How are these tests giving you the opportunity to be stronger and ready for whatever's next? I look forward to Sunday with you. Grace and peace.